Hello everyone and welcome back to my 100% playthrough of Valiant for Doom 2. We'll be doing it on Ultraviolence with, you know, Pistol Start every single level. This is map 28, Light Bridge is too far, which so far, yeah, like a little rhyme, is aesthetically a continuation of the last map, but in terms of gameplay, it's completely different. It's arguably the hardest in the entire set. And I'm genuinely surprised with, the, with how hard it is that it's not the penultimate level. In my opinion, it does deserve it would be a nice little twist, but alas, the actual penultimate level ain't too bad, but I think this one's a little better. But nonetheless, we're not here to, you know, compare levels or complain. We're here to play the levels, and unless if it's really bad, well, we're not gonna complain the whole time. So, yeah, we're just gonna take care of these imps. Oh, yeah, there's shotgunners here. Don't let them catch you up, guard. And we get to see the main gimmick of this level right here, which is uh, we can we can walk on bridges made of, ref of refracted light, I believe it is, which is very cool. And honestly, I have no idea how it's even done in Vanilla Doom. I'm just so impressed. I can't even really put into put it into words. And I fell. And it's cool. Let's just open the bridge and open another bridge. If there is anything nice about falling, it's that we can look at the bridges again. That's barely a punishment, if it is a punishment at all, if you ask me. One of few times where being punished isn't really a punishment. I guess that's, uh, I'm getting redundant here. Okay. Get ready for our first major tussle. We're we'll gonna have to fight a couple of cybruisers. That we can kinda use to our advantage to take care of some of these guys. But yeah, so don't count on it. Alright, we have three cybrizers to take care of. With, uh, well, really just a shotgun. We're not gonna have enough chain ammo. Okay, okay. Okay, well, I guess one to take care of with the shotgun. Which is actually really good. Alright. No! Oh, oh geez, geez. Okay, it's cool. It's fine. It's fine. We are still alive. That's all that matters. But, there's health. Health that we desperately, desperately need. So I'm just gonna go around exploring for it and we'll be back in good shape sooner or later. See, look, 100 health already. Ugh, that was a close one. Let's grab this rocket launcher and put those worries to the side. Some more rockets and, you know, even a book bag for more storage on help. That's not the rocket launcher. So, still love you, SSG. I mean, SCG. I swear I'm not having an affair. Well, I guess at this point, it's more like an open relationship, but... You know, I should probably stop talking about this crap. I'm gonna get my... I'm gonna get in trouble. Alright, just gonna blow you up, up. Okay, we're just gonna... Yeah, this part's pretty easy. We've barely gotten to a glimpse of how hard this level can be. I mean, honestly, now that I'm really thinking about it, this level isn't even really that hard. At least the way I'm doing it, it shouldn't be too bad. There's only like one fight. Well, actually two fights to stick in my head when it comes to difficulty. That's not to say those fights aren't hard, I'm just saying besides those fights, it's kind of a typical Valiant affair. If you've beaten every other level in Valiant, then this one really shouldn't be that bad. Okay, come here, Power Knight. Alright, we're gonna explore this upper area because we're gonna find some good stuff up here. Not gonna spoil it yet, but... Uh, why is DSDA doing glitching? Hang on. Just wait for it to stop. Okay, you done DSDA doing? Nope, it's not done. Hang out. You done? Okay, I think the SDA Doom is done bugging out. Like I said, I apologize for when it happens, because I know when it happens, I hear it in the audio. And it really sucks because it messes up my recordings, but... At this point, I'm just kind of learning to live with it. Usually it doesn't last for more than a couple of seconds, so... I mean, it's something I'm sorry for, but if I'm being honest, I'm not sorry enough to re-record the whole thing. I don't want to have a really good run and start it all over, because the SDA Doom decided to bug out. 
Maybe I should record demos, but eh, maybe not. Honestly, I don't feel like I don't feel like recording the demo and then recording commentary over it, especially for like those really long maps. Oh, mega armor! I probably should have just grabbed that to begin with. Yeah, I've already wasted like four rockets on this guy, maybe even five. Let's just look at the pretty bridge. Actually, first I want some health. I feel like there's a berserk pack in this area that I always forget about. Right here, haha. <laughs> yeah, I always forget to go after it, but not this time. Yeah, I'm gonna be honest though, you get absolutely loaded with ammo on this level, so... You're probably not gonna use this berserk pack much, but... You know what, I'll try to get some use out of it. I'll try though, no promises. Let's just go ahead and walk on the bridge though, the bridge of light. One of the coolest effects I've ever seen in a Doom level. Very cool. And look, we even have a nice old super shotgun waiting for us. Yeah, I think those two rockets miss. There we go, just give me the super shotgun. No one gets hurt besides the demons. Oh, of course, the super shotgun's booby trapped. Well, not to matter, we got a rocket launcher. And plenty of rockets, so they don't really. Like I said, I've said it a million times. They don't stand a chance. Okay. Give me the med kit so I can have perfect 100 health, because, you know, I like that perfect 100 health. I'm not going to act like I have OCD, because I think people who act like they have social or mental disorders when they clearly don't are annoying, stupid, and cringy. So I'm not going to act like I do, but if I did, I would definitely be triggered by not having perfect 200 health, which I'm not going to have anyway. That's fine. 167? 167. That's also cool. Alright, give him some more rockets. And, um, yep, there we go. Probably should have just grabbed those med kits in hindsight before going through the soul sphere. But the, you're still alive. Ooh, and he got a nice little hit on me. Okay. Yeah, you gotta be careful in this section. A ton of arachnorbs and gackos means trouble. Alright, come here. Anyone else want some? No, doesn't seem like it. Alright, how about we follow the armor bonus road, like the yellow big brick road, but not as aesthetically pleasing. And we can run over here and blow up a revenant, because that's fun. And don't forget to push this button to bring up another aesthetically pleasing light road. Oh, never mind, it just opens the door. That's boring. No, I don't like that. Oh, crap. Can't believe I fell. Here we go. We're running a little low on chain gun ammo. Not like low low, but we're gonna have to be cautious of it. Yeah, there's also some arachnorbs in cages. They probably got put in there for being too much of a frickin' nuisance. It's really just annoyance. Probably pulling pranks, like, you know, pooping in a bag, setting it on fire, and putting it at someone's door. Maybe ding-dong ditching. Selling drugs to miners, you know, just general annoying stuff. Alright, this trap is a bit tricky if you let it get the best of you, but we don't let that happen here. Just blow up the arch fall and it is just a regular fire. Oh yeah, we can get some use out of that berserk pack too. Come on, Imps, I can't get a use out of this berserk pack with you crowding around. Man, this could be the perfect way to get some use out of this berserk pack. But you know what? We need to use the chain gun more, because we're running out of time with it. Alright, I'll finish you off with a bunch. There, nice little compromise. Everyone wins. Except for the arachnorbs, they die. Come on. Third time's the charm. Give me that box. Okay, now we need to... Oh, power knights. 
Yeah. No thanks. We need to find a way to get over there, so we're just gonna do a bit of exploring. We finally get the plasma rifle, but we're going. Oh no! Okay, that was not good. This is not good. 35 health at this point in the level. It's not good. I think this is the second time I've got struck by a cyber as a rocket. I'm telling you, it hurts every single time. Hey, at least we got all of this L. So it's not all bad. More rockets too. Alright, we're gonna straight front over here. Okay, let's see here. You're gonna get your rocket ready. Alright, we got another side wizard to deal with, and I'm not letting them get third ro three rockets on me. At least not now, when I really can't take it. There we go. And then we- oh wait, no, I already pushed the button. Now you may be wondering to yourself, how in the heck are we gonna get that secret soul sphere right here? Well, the answer is actually rather simple. What you wanna do is run over here, jump down here, straight front over here, Grab these if you want to, but you don't really need to. Kill this Pinky. Not really necessary. Take this teleporter and bam. Brace, I know it sounds complicated, but it's actually really simple. Any more rockets for me to grab? Okay, I'll take those. And I'll grab this clip. Alright, now we just need to take the other way, and we can go ahead and get to the final leg of this level with the last, like, 241 enemies are, that looks like that's how many there are. Okay, actually let's use a chain gun. So satisfying. Oop. Get that door open again. Ah, screw it. Come on, why can't I punch him? There we go. Guess my Tyson skills could use a little bit of work, admittedly. Oh, darn it. And I guess my platforming skill is good. Well, that's not really platforming. I didn't even jump, but... You know what? Forget about it. We'll just go back up there. More rockets. Hey, if there's anything nice about falling down here, is that I got like 10 more rockets than I initially had when I was up there. So that's good. 73 rockets, 320 cells, 80 shells. Um, the only thing I really have to worry about ammo-wise is bullets, and I'm sure... I mean, those are everywhere, so we shouldn't have to worry. Let's walk on another aesthetically pleasing light bridge. This time, not falling. But instead, we can prioritize headhunting that chain gunner. Two and one. Very nice. Come on, kill him. Yeah, I was just paying attention to that one group of monsters. Yeah, I saw his uh, fireball. So I was just like, man, I gotta take care of him immediately or else he's gonna annoy me. I don't even know what that lost soul is doing. Take care of you. Oh yeah, I could just do this. I need you dead most of all, Arachnatron. But also you two revenants. You two gotta go too. Ugh, yeah, 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 I'm not using rockets when you're around. What am I doing? Ah, that can be used- I can, oh, come on, I got better aim than this. Sometimes I'm tempted to use uh, uh, one of those little dot thingies on the screen, what are they called? Cursors? Aiming thingies? Uh, I haven't used one in Doom in so long, I forgot what they're called, but uh, yeah, sometimes I'm tempted to use those, admittedly. Pretty sure there should be some armor around here. Okay, that lowers the Megasphere. I'm gonna save that for later. Ooh, this is a little awkward place to be in. It's cool though, we can make it work, it's worth epic. There's gonna be an arch file over here, so... Uh, yeah, we should probably go ahead and run for that Megasphere, shouldn't we? Okay... Yeah, actually, let's just run for the Megasphere. I don't want to risk getting hit at the wrong time by an Arachnitron and just friggin' dying. Alright, I'm gonna rocket you guys. 
Yeah, I'm just gonna shotgun all of you. Ooh, I'm getting hit scanned. That's not very good. But you wanna know what is cool? More berserk punching. Now oh, that's cool. Yeah, I know the, the Tyson gameplay in this level isn't exactly the most interesting, but you know what? Take what you can get. You're lucky I even remember to grab it at all. And I don't wanna sound mean, I'm sorry. Oh, there was the armor I was looking for earlier. Well, I can't really use it now. Yeah, let's try to stay cautious of those chain gunners. Where oh, there's one right here. That's the one who was probably hitting me all the time anyway. I mean, if he just wants to get hit by a projectile, I, I don't mind. That seems like he doesn't want to, so I'll just kill him. Okay. This looks like super shotgun bait to me. Nothing that really warrants pulling out the god tier chain gun, but... No. Okay, we're gonna go for up there, because there's an invulnerability up there. You can't see it, but it's a secret, and we're gonna want to use it. Not over here yet. Not just yet. We already got plenty of rockets anyway. So how do you get it? Well, it's very simple. Just be cautious of that cyber demon. He's a, he's a pain, to say the least, but he's not too bad. Just run over here, we're gonna have to kill a couple of monsters before we can get to it. There we go. Rock got some imps. I said rock, you know what, chain gun. Chain gun, just chain gun them, that's what I meant to say. Okay, there's gonna be a button on the right side of this elevator, so shoot it. And then hop down here. Bam. We're gonna put it to use right away too. Hopefully not get wrecked by the chain gunners. Okay, then we're just gonna grab all that. Yeah, you know I like to you know afford myself. And this one fight right here is why. There's gonna be a lot of cybers, this is the main problem, so we're gonna be trying to knock them out and stuff. Oh great, I'm already running out of it. Okay, then. we're just gonna... Yeah, you kinda see why this fight's hard. Of the hardest fight of the level, to be honest, which is why I like to save the invulnerability for it. The side bruises, it's just too easy for them to come out of nowhere and mess me up if you ask me. Definitely need to waste these arachnorms as well. And the spider mastermind, I'm surprised she's even gotten this far. Yeah, let's hear it with some of our own medicine. Come on, go down, go down, go down, go down, go down. There we go, she's dead. Oh, she was scaring me. She was very durable today. So I guess I'm a little proud of her, but in the way where I still hate her guts. I gotta be careful, I'm a little low on health and such, so... Alrighty. Oof, what a tough battle. Well, at least we got my kids. Alright, honestly, there isn't really much else to this level in terms of difficulty. Once I kill this Cyber Demon, I can breathe a sigh of relief, because the worst will be over. Oh, that fossil is bait. I see. And he's still alive. I'm not even sure what he's doing. I'm just kind of keeping an eye on him while I rocket these random dudes. Oh, there you are. Well, good riddance to you, I guess. You were bothering me so much even though you barely did anything. Bothering me more than any of these guys ever could. With all the rockets I have and how slow they are. Alright, let's grab some more silver. We don't really have a lot to take care of the cyber demon. So we're just gonna have to work with what we have because honestly, I just want him gone. I don't want him nailing me in the back with a rocket at the wrong time. Oh! 
Arachnitron. Well, great, I gotta deal with that Arachnitron too. Ugh. Darn it. I don't think he can really see me from here. Close one. Alright, let's switch to rockets. Just like E2M8, huh? Three at a time, just like he does it. Okay, come on, you gotta be almost dead, pal. There we go. Alright, the worst of this level is basically over. Oh, we got this Cyber Minky Biz. Okay, just gonna grab all this good stuff. Yeah, okay, now I think I can safely say that the worst of this level is over. We still have one major fight to go, but honestly, I don't think it's anywhere near as bad as uh, the last one. Alright, just a couple of rockets for good measure. Oh, crap. Okay, that's what I get for underestimating this fight. That is what I get. Oh my god, that was so close. Like, ugh. Okay. Now I know not to underestimate super rooms. Oh my god. And don't underestimate the sheer destructive power of rockets even when you're the one using them. Bro, that's 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 twice that I've clowned myself. And who is shooting at me? I don't really appreciate that. Are you the one who's in there? Maybe it was a super imp over here. I guess I'll never know because, well, hopefully they're dead. No, they're not dead. Who is that? Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna take this a little slow. Yeah, when it comes to how you use this invulnerability in this fight, it's either the fight with the imps and the arachnitrons, or the imps with the cyber lizards and cyber mancubi. One or the other. Oh, it was you! Yeah, I saw him out of the corner of my eye. Jerk. Okay, we got like, what, 30 monsters left? I thought there was only 410 monsters in this map, but it says 418, so I assume Archfiles must have done some funny business then. Okay, we're almost out of bullets, so... Yeah, after that little goof up, I'm playing very safe. But maybe not the most safe. Oh my god. Yeah, I guess not the most safe. Let's just stop using rockets before I goof myself another time. Okay, we have 100% kills. We are done. I'm just gonna leave before I kill myself. Oof. Alrighty, as always, thank you guys for watching, and you guys have a great day. See ya.